Hi everyone, it's Matilda and I'm back to work on the recipe journal again. I haven't been recording for about two or three weeks I think because I've been just trying to um, figure out what I want to do with the cover, um, just to get inspiration for it and such. So yeah, it's time for me to finish the cover. So I'm going to use a stencil here on the uh, cover and use um, whipped spackle. Uh, this is a type of texture paste. Um, yeah, and I'm going to use it on the cover um, just to create um, like a textured background. And uh, oops, just going to put some tape here and I'm just, I want to just stand up quickly just to see like if it's where I want it to be. I'm just going to make sure, yes, it's the right side um, the cover. Um, yeah, I think that's fine. That's fine. Okay. So this is the type of thing that I should have done before actually sewing the signatures, but I guess I was just eager to get this done. <laughs> so I just haven't, um, or haven't, I just didn't do that. Um, so some of these, oops, some of these pieces um, are kind of like bent up a bit, but I'll try and um, yeah, just watch, um, watch, watch them carefully. So I'm just going to put quite a thin layer over these and um, like on some of the edges, I won't um, be super like like some of the edges will be a bit rough or you know I'll leave them a bit I won't like cover the whole stencil if you know what I mean okay so um, as you can see I um, don't have the gel nails anymore um, I mean I was supposed to go back there and redo them or like refill it or whatever you call it in English um, but I just decided to not do it um, anymore my I mean my natural nails are quite um, they're thin and they like bend easily and everything but I'm just gonna try and make my own nails be a bit um, be a bit thicker and um, yeah I just felt like with the gel nails they look really pretty uh, but only for about like a week and a half or two weeks and then it was like I already wanted to um, go back and uh, fix them but I just don't have I feel like right now I don't have the money um, to do that because then I would have to go um, would have to do that more often oh is this oh, I have something here oh it's maybe something from the fabric okay um, So yeah, I just decided not to do it anymore, but it was pretty for a while. <laughs> and I guess I just need to get more patient when like painting nails and stuff because I think that's what I also like was excited about that I wouldn't have to paint my own nails as often that they would just be pretty anyway but 
um, yeah I just my patience isn't the best so I always like think I've let the nails dry enough and then go away to do something and the nails are ruined <laughs> so that happens a lot okay that one is sticking out this is taking a bit longer than if I want because like, I can't have a thick layer of this on here I think I don't think it's like I think the stencil is uh, too detailed for that um, I've tried this like on um like I've done a sample on a different cover so I kind of know um, what look I'm going for so hopefully I will be um, achieving that but we'll see So today, uh, today has been a really nice day, just like weather-wise. It's been a bit chilly, but it's been like a nice chilly, or chill? No, chilly. A uh, nice chilly um, fall day, because it's been a bit, um, like a bit cold, and like the air has just been like crisp and nice. And because I was out um, just for like a short um, bike ride and then a walk. Um, so yeah, all I was missing was like a bit of sun, but we got that later. <laughs> so that's good. Okay. Um. I think I'm pretty happy with this. Just have to see um just don't know if like I think this is I don't like how that's behaving right now though. Um I think the thickness like the the thickness of this layer is good. I hope so. I can't really remember how I did on the, the sample, but yeah, I hope it's good. Okay. Oops. My hair is over here. Over here. <laughs> over here. Over here. Um, do I dare lifting this up and see oh I hope it's gonna be good okay come here tape and then this okay um and I have yes I'm just gonna put the stencil on here Yeah, that's pretty good, I think. Just gonna remove some like excess in some places where there it's like sticking up. Maybe I can see that. Some of some of this is you know mostly um, it's gonna be like covered with lace and things like that but yeah so uh, I'm just gonna have to let this uh, sit aside 
and um, dry and I'll be back after that. Okay, so now this is dry and I'm going to actually um, use some uh, paint that I'm gonna mix with a bit of water and I'm gonna do some um, like little splats and splatters with some white paint. So I'm just gonna put this to uh, the side and I'm gonna mix this paint with some water. I'm not gonna need much, but I think that's good. And here I have some paper. Okay, and just keep some water in this spray bottle. And then it's gonna mix with this bigger one here. Might need a bit more paint actually. Oh, it'll fall over. Hang on a second. so that I know I'll get enough. I just want to get a good consistency because if it's like if it's too like firm I'm not going to get many like splats and stuff. It's going to be more like big blobs. Yeah, this might be good. And I have some papers. So I'm just going to try it out on that uh, before. Uh, I did some tests here yesterday, so I'm just going to uh, do it again to see if, if it's a good consistency. Maybe a little bit more water to this. I think so. Okay, I'm hoping this is enough now. And I'm gonna, um, get this box and um, do the splatters in here and maybe oh, I didn't use this one yesterday did I use that big one maybe I did um, let's just put that here 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 uh, okay let's see that's too much Yeah, I think this is going to be good. Let's just put this over here. It has some like bubbles in it, but I think it's okay. Okay, so let's just put these to the side. And then I have to draw. Um, a draw, but you know, wipe that up a bit. I'll just put this in here because I really don't want the album to be messed up. Okay. And I'll try to secure, like, <laughs> so that I won't um, ruin the edges or so. Okay, and I'm just gonna do a little bit at a time because I really wanna see that I like it. Okay. A 
I like those tiny ones. I think that could be enough actually. Maybe some more here in the middle. Isn't that fun? Okay, so now it's just time to let this dry and I'll be back once again. Okay, so now it's the day after and the the paint has dried. Sorry, I just wanted to show you a bit, um, a bit more up close, kind of what it looks like. I really like that. So now um, I'm just gonna finish up the cover. So I have a few uh, laces and other things that I'm gonna use on this. Um, Cover. So uh, this one I've already um, cut. I might want to um, finish up this edge a bit better. Let me see. Do that. And something like that. Here's the thread. Okay. So I have this lace. I'm going to use some. Um, okay, I could just show you a bit closer. So this, um, maybe you can't call this lace, but this ribbon. Then I have this, oops, this lace with small hearts on it. And then this one. And I'm gonna use this, um, There's it's a wooden uh, embellishment and I have I'm not sure if you're if you're going to be able to see it, but I have actually put some white paint on it so that it's not um, as like it's um, I guess that you can see some of the like the wood um, color I guess through it, but it's kind of like. Um, Soften up, softened with the the white paint. So anyway, I'm just gonna cut these pieces, kind of like how I um, the length I want, and um, this has to be. Let me just trim this part because I've laid these out before. Oh wait, they're not. Ah, I'll just separate these parts because uh, what I want to do is uh, this, like one bit of this is going to peek through on the top and the other is going to peek through on the bottom. So instead of um, cutting it and um, like covering this part up, um, I just thought I'll just um, cut this in half and use each piece. Um, well, that wasn't good, but that's, that's fine. Um, yeah, so that the whole lace piece gets gets used up. Okay, let's see if yeah, something like that's enough. So I'll just um, cut this off. Let's see. Because that's, yeah, this is a bit too long, but it's fine. So, um, after I filmed yesterday, uh, I got a call and I got called for a job interview for a job that I applied for, um, just like the other day. And um, I went into the interview this morning, actually. I borrowed my mom's car and went to the interview it's like uh, it was in a city that's about one and a half like maybe one hour 45 minutes away so yeah I borrowed her car to do that 
so I think the interview went pretty well. It went like it was super short though. Um, usually when I've been to job interviews, they've been like you know between half an hour and an hour or something, depending on you know what sort of job or whatever. I was there for like 15 minutes. Um, it was super short. And, um, yeah, but it, I mean, it went well, but it was, yeah, it was really short. So, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Okay, so we have these two. I hope they kind of like match up. Well, it doesn't have to be perfect, but that's good. Okay, we have those two. And then this is gonna be like on the bottom here somewhere. I don't like how that's flipping up, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, and then this. I'm not sure. Do I want this to go all the way out or? Hmm. I probably. Um. This is going to be under this. I think I want this. Maybe I need another piece of this. Like, maybe this needs to be... Or could it be a little bit shorter? I just... I'm just... I'm going to, like, arrange these a bit. And then we'll see. Because um, I want to kind of see... The whole thing so I can decide what looks best. Okay, so it's kind of crooked, but okay, let's just do something like that. And then I want this to. Anyway, come on. Oh, okay. Where approximately do I need it to be? Something like that. It kind of like wants to get stuck to this piece under here. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't want to work with me. Okay, go. And it's so like delicate this lace, so I don't want to mess it up. But okay, let's. I mean, yeah, something like that. Okay, good. So we have this, and what? It's. I won't use this side. Yeah, I think that's good. Actually, let me just cut it off right there. And just cut off because. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Cut off a tiny bit here. See if I like that or if I have to redo this. Because I want, oh yeah, I wanted this to cover up those little things there. Okay, so this is, it was a bit crooked, but maybe I won't. Um, think about that. Yeah, they're both a bit crooked, but hmm. this is truly slow crafting. <laughs> but you know that already from watching the first bit of this series. 
I don't like how that's just adjust these a bit more again and it's gonna get too short and I'm gonna have to cut another piece but that's fine I don't know which side I like best no it's the other one strings and stuff here okay okay I think that's good and I'm not sure you probably can't see you real like very well here but um doesn't matter that much and then I want this to be kind of like that and then I have these uh, Scrabble letters that um, that I'm gonna use on here as my title and these spell out the word uh, recipe but in Swedish because I just felt like um, I wanted it to be I just wanted the title to be Swedish and this goes something like that Something like that. Let's just show you a bit closer because you probably can't see that well from, oops, sorry. So something like that. I think that's good. So first of all, I'm gonna try and like glue these laces to this other piece here so that I know that, you know, cause I don't wanna be eyeballing this and then some of the lace are gonna be, or is, well, <laughs> some of the lace will be like covered up um, or something. I don't want that. So let's put this aside and let's get this piece right here. My little mat. And where did that other piece go? Oh, it's right here. Okay. So I'm gonna, gonna get some glue and then glue over that. Um, so I think I'm just gonna use the glossy accents because that's what I usually use. And um, I'm just gonna put, and it doesn't have to be like, oh, do I need the, yeah, it doesn't have to be really, oops. <laughs> like glue down um, on onto this lace uh, it's better or like the most important is that the most important thing is that it's gonna be um, glued down to the actual cover so as long as it sticks somewhat good to this other lace that's good Let's keep the paper near. This is full of glue now. Just wipe some off. Put that down. And then, let me see. That's good, I think. Oops. 
it's escaping. Oh. That did not work out well. Um, let's put some more glue on it. A tiny bit. Just didn't want to be straight. So much glue on here now. This is the right side. I'm just have. I just have to check. Yes, it is. Okay. Oh no, it's like not. Um, wasn't lined up on each side properly. <laughs> Sorry, this is taking forever for me. It's like bending outwards a bit, which is annoying. Here we go, I think. Yes. So you're not gonna see like the whole um, heart, but I don't want this. Um, I don't want this line here uh, in the like at the bottom to be showing so just thought that would be the easiest way to do this I mean some can be showing but like I want most of it to be hidden need it to be a little bit more towards this side, I think. So that they line up. I think that's okay. Probably showing well that's all right okay um, so maybe I should oh wait I don't want to put the album on here if it's glued here Let's put that there. Oh, I could. Yeah, let's just put this here. Put the album on top of that. And then I'm just gonna. And I think it's best just to put some glue in the middle here first. And then see kind of where I want it. And I want to stand up.
Okay, we're getting somewhere, yay. <laughs> so, um, I just didn't want to use too much glue on here. I can cut off these little strings here. I know it's gonna fray uh, probably here, but let's just remove it for now. So I need to glue this down a bit better. I actually don't know how much this is gonna show through later, but we'll see. And I also got a call yesterday um, where they were asking me um, at the newspaper if I could come in and work Monday. So I will be doing that. So it's just for one day, but something at least. So I think I'm just going to keep gluing and then it can dry afterwards. I, wanna... I don't think I need to glue this lace it down, but just this piece that was like, um, it was, how do you say it? Like it was, um, Flying out of the. <laughs> Just gonna see that. Okay, there we go. Okay. Um, or should I let it dry? No. I'm just gonna keep going. Um, so for this one, yes, I cut a piece. Let's see again if I, if I like that or if I don't. Well, I'm just going to go for it and um, just going to put some lace here, lace, glue here on the lace. <laughs> towards the top. Is that kind of straight? Let me see. Yeah. Mm. 
And then I'll secure the edges a bit more with glue. Sorry, I just uh, bumped in, bumped my hand into my glass. Okay, now I can remove these. Okay, so yes, it's the time to glue. Oh, did it follow the scissor? Yes, it did. Okay. So it's time to glue this down. So I think I want it something like that, but a little bit higher up. Something like that. Okay, so this is going to be interesting. Oh, some of these. I don't want to come off. Well, this one too. Okay. I think I'm just gonna have to like put glue in some of these spaces, like some of the spaces in between the hearts. Oh, sorry, I'm totally out of frame. Um, okay. Let's do that and see if, like, yeah, I have no idea how this is going to go, but we'll put it down and see. So... Something like that. Yeah, might have might have to have pressure on this for a bit. Okay, I'm just gonna sit here and let this dry for a bit, and you don't have to. Um, I'll let you know once it's dry, okay? <laughs> okay, so now this is a little bit dry and I can start gluing down these tiles and I'm just going to use the glossy accents to, uh, to for that and I um, kind of know how I want these letters so I'm just going to Kind of see where I did this uh, second to last one, and then yeah, I'm just gonna glue down that first, maybe. Yeah. So you see a bit of that, okay? Something like that. Sorry if my head's totally in the way. <laughs> oh, this wants to like stick properly right away. Well, now, it, you know, it's, it won't stick until this is dry, but it's like, yeah, it wouldn't really move that much. Do I want to glue this down? It's kind of like at an angle here. I'll just do that. Okay. 
maybe this has more like space in between. Okay, just do the next one. Ooh, it's down. So this will be a bit. I can hold it there, but I think it, it will. Um, it won't be completely straight, like some of these others are more straight. Let's see, oops, maybe I have to be a bit careful there. Need. I just want to get in a bit more glue underneath it down here. Okay, just move it. Just try and hold it right there. wants to stay there now. I'm actually really liking this cover. Um, so when I was like trying to find inspiration for a cover and was just struggling with figuring out what I wanted to do, um, I mean something like this came to mind like doing the stenciling and um, paint splattering but how this actually turned out is a lot better than I thought it would and I was thinking maybe I want to use some um, maybe I want to use some um, like um, white uh, pearls or something like half pearls and put around it but um, yeah, I'm just going to take them out and see if I want to use them. I don't feel like it's, it's probably not necessary, but let's take, take them out and see if I like it or if I even have some that will work. Um, because they need to be quite small and these are probably not small enough, like Like, it's going to be like too, like, okay, okay, I won't put them like that and just like, but no, I, I don't think, and I would want, you know, maybe one of these sizes and then a bunch of small ones, but I don't have any, like, you know, like this size or something, but I don't have any white pearls in that size. I do have like perfect pearls and stuff, but I'm never good with those. I wouldn't dare doing it right here on the cover. Because I don't think this color, no, it's way too dark. Okay. Okay, so I think the cover is done now. I just need to figure out, like the last thing I need to figure out is what to do with the strings down here. I'm not gonna keep them like this, so I'm either gonna 
uh, just cut them off short or I'm gonna uh, like put something on them on the inside like some put hearts and stuff on them um, I'll just that's the only thing I need to figure out but I will I will you know you will see what I did uh, what I decided to do in the final flip through of this journal and um, I'll also probably put something on the back or so, but I'll leave that for that video as well. So thank you so much for joining this um, sort of, you know, craft with me series for making this journal. It took a while, but I'm finally, well, you know, pretty much done. So thank you so much for watching and have a great day, everyone. Bye.